News at noon. With the number of opioid overdose deaths, related deaths soaring in Erie County, lawmakers are trying to curb that epidemic with a new crisis hotline. But to get that, they're going to need more money. And 7 Eyewitnesses reporter Matt Beauvais just got back from a committee meeting taking place just now where the fight for funding got heated. He joins us live in the newsroom. Matt? Yeah, Katie, it certainly did. That fight now continues. I just got back from the Erie County Legislature 20 minutes ago, and they just decided that they will not vote on this new opioid hotline until their session next week. Do you understand how bad that is? Do you understand what we have to live through every single, every single day? Every single day. Every single day. Every single day we have to look Now that's Avi and his wife, Julie Israel. Their son, Michael, died from an opioid addiction in 2011. They, along with other family members, asked the legislator to pass a $375,000 proposal that would create a special hotline operated by drug experts for those dealing with the addiction. At times, as you heard, things got very, very heated. Legislators cut off by family members and vice versa. And now every legislature that spoke today address just how big of a problem this really is. But the question is, where will the money to fund this hotline